This place is huge. Yes, it is. <laughs> Do I want to follow it? I need to find the key card so I can enter research room where... Wait, so... That is... Not proper grammar. I need to find the key card so I can enter research room where Amabel is. Uh, it should be the research room. But anyway, not a big deal. See what, see what this way. What's this way? Oh, there I am. Wait, that... That doesn't really clear things up. Where exact... I don't understand how that's laid out. I'm look... Okay, so if I go right and then go... Mm, I don't know. I'll figure it out as I go. Looks like nature is reclaiming this place. Alright, so is this the, um... The hostile fauna? Whoa. What's that sound? Is there something here? I was gonna say, is this the hostile local fauna that's been mentioned? Because it doesn't look natural. It looks very black and strange. And I can't see how it could possibly, possibly live in such an environment. Oh, yep. Is it coming? Coming or going? It's going. What the hell is down there? You know what? I don't even care. I'm not going there. And that's that. What the hell has this been bricked off? I won't budge. Is this where I came from? Oh, is this the other side? Yeah, okay, this is the other side. The Archaic would never ask that employees work longer than the recommended eight-hour shift, but understands that enthusiasm for their work and dedication to the team may often motivate them to do so. Thank you for not letting us down. <laughs> oh, fuck you, Archaic. Nah, it's on the other side of the wall. Other side of the wall, it's fine. The kennels. Oh, of course the kennels are unlocked. Oh, I see bloody paw prints on the ground. That's wonderful. I'm gonna love this. I love me some dogs. I'm gonna pet them and we're gonna have a good time. Oh yeah. If you notice, I'm staying crouched. The label says the crate contains dog food. <laughs> that is a lot of dog food. How come it allows... How come it allows me to make noise on the fence? That's strange. Is there a reason for that? Whoa. Where the hell is that coming from? I presume this is where the dogs slept. It's pretty filthy. I think I hear it on the other side of the wall. the hell? Whoa. Am I, am, am I hearing like the, the spirits of the dogs or something? An imprint left behind? What the hell?
Whoa. Whoa. What just Dark, happened? Isn't it? Echo! 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 Kinda empty. Now this, this is what it's like to be me, buried deep within the cavernous expanse you call a mind. You see, this is what puts me in such a bad mood. We spend all this time messing about with door codes, levers, human appendages, and it turns out, at the blink of an eye, I can just block it all out. Whoosh! Gone. Just you and me on some kind of messed up holiday. You think I can conjure up some margaritas? No? Shall we get the hell out of here then? Well, it's hardly better, but it is more interesting. Just. Thank you for that, Clarence. Much appreciated. Sounds like something is crawling inside the walls. I don't think it would be wise to go in there yet. It does sound like there's something in the walls. And I see... Openings covered in goo. Let's not go there. What'd you jot down? I need to light up the dark corridors and the kennel somehow. Uh, flares? Is this the same? It is a long corridor, but I don't hear the noise. What the hell? What happened in here? What the hell did happen in here? No, I hear it. But there is light in here. The lights are on. Maybe it's okay. What about this side? The lights were off, right? That's the issue? Yeah. Okay, this side might be okay. Maybe I can, like, cover up the holes using those boxes? Is the, like what what is in the walls? Okay, that seems good. It's almost like an animal did this, but there's no claw marks. <laughs> Bloody paw prints. Are the dogs inside of the walls? Do I want to take a peek inside? What is that smell? Okay. I don't know if that did any good, but... Let's leave it. What the hell is down here? The bloody paw prints come from here. Standard stuff. A couple of collars, a leash, and a water bowl. As well as some rotten meat, apparently. Okay, so they're they're dead, but then why do I still hear them? I hope I've seen the last of these appalling things. Me too. Me too. Judging from the claw and bite marks, I'd say another dog killed this one. Hopefully. Did they go at, at each other? Shit. Yep. Fucking Clarence. Fucking Clarence. <sighs> oh, 
Alright, can I go down this hallway? Why do I feel like these lights are going to start shutting off in sequence? Alright, they go up to here. I hear the wind. It sounds like that's outside. The paw prints lead outside. So much blood. These things, they're taking me. They're taking me. They need me. They're beckoning me in. Wilbur Frisk Efficiency Efficiency Report. Efficiency Assessment as sanctioned by Elof Carpenter. Elevated. Subject. Wilbur Frisk, Chief Overseer, Shelter Research Station, Greenland. Report filed by Garrett Quinn. February 20th, 2000. My assessment of Frisk begins today. I have taken up station as his personal assistant, and my report will run for six months. Since taking over control of the facility from Bren Stafferson in 1980, Frisk has turned up precious few results, and I intend to discover why. March 5th, 2000. Having observed Frisk for two weeks, it seems my earlier assumptions may have been quite incorrect. He displays passion, efficiency, and above all, commitment to the cause. These qualities are ably demonstrated by his recent discovery of what is being called the Turngat Tomb at the primary excavation. He has, of course, called for a full-scale investigation. April 26, 2000. A small-scale epidemic has resulted from the opening of the tomb. This will be a perfect opportunity to fully observe Frisk's ability to deal with high-pressure scenarios. May 24, 2000. The epidemic has developed beyond all control. There have been many casualties, and it is hard not to highlight Wilbur as the primary cause. June 13, 2000. Frisk has lost all control. While the number of survivors have fled, and others have holed themselves up in the mess hall, Frisk has chosen to lock himself away in the kennels with the remaining dogs for protection. I have had no choice but to follow him here in order to complete my report. September Unknown. I've lost sense of time, but Frisk seems to almost be enjoying himself. He's become very close to the canines. Every day he leaves the compound to forage for food in the main base, which he then feeds to the animals, despite a number of them being infected. October. Frisk has developed some strange symptoms. He's becoming sensitive to light. The slightest light scares him away. He's also displaying almost animalistic tendencies. He's been digging out some of the walls and hiding behind them. Further, I suspect he may be sneaking out of the, out of the facility at night, possibly even into the mines. Some of the dogs have turned up dead. Entry 8. I've been observing Frisk for some time now, and I believe I can conclude my report. Frisk displays outstanding efficiency, though I am now forced to call his judgment into doubt. Despite plenty of rations remaining, I believe he may have begun eating the canines. Entry 9. When I woke this morning, there was a corpse lying on the floor beside me. I broke out the flashlight. Fearful Frisk may have been savaged or taken his own life. As I did so, I could not help but see at the corner of my vision. Frisk fleeing back into the shadows. The dead man was Dr. Roberts. A scientist I was sure had escaped into the mines at the first sign of the epidemic. He had bite marks on his side, and looked to have been dragged some way. In addition, his tongue was missing. I will continue to observe Frisk, while taking additional security precautions. Holy shit, he's turned into some sort of feral monster in the walls. He's the one that's sensitive to light, he's the one that's in the walls. Maybe I can restore power. What is this? What did that do? Oh, it sounds like it's doing something in sequence, but what? What 
was it doing? A switchboard controlling the electricity. Whoa. That scared me. Oh. Alright, it looks like I only need to activate it once and then just leave it on, I guess. Or leave it off, whatever I did. Let's go see what I did. Oh, shit. God, you can... It's like I can hear him in the walls walking. I can hear him. Okay, I, I blocked the holes though. W will I be okay? Since I did that? Let me just do this again, just to be sure. I think I might be okay. Yeah, these instantly turn off, so I need to prepare the hallway, which I believe I've already done. Okay, here's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna hold this. And I'm gonna run. I'm gonna fucking run. Okay. Okay, good, good, good. Whoa! Oh, Jesus! Blatant corpses! You lot must be programmed to just search out danger and throw yourselves head first at it. I'm starting to become seriously desensitized here. Where the hell, where did you even come from? There's nowhere for you to be up here. I don't even think you're real. I think I'm just hallucinating at this point. Okay. Oh god. So, does it just go in sequence and I just need to follow it the whole way? That didn't work out too well. <laughs> Did I wait too long? Here it comes. So many very, so very many holes. Oh god. Oh god. Oh, seriously? I was... Oh, there wasn't even anything there. Okay, one more time. <laughs> That's cruel. They make you wait. They the save is at just the wrong time. Well, actually, it's probably an auto save. So I imagine whatever time it's synced up to, as far as the lights go, is just whenever you get there. All right, there's no point in me holding the flare. It doesn't do anything, obviously. And we're off. Let's go ahead and do this. Yeah. Okay. We're good. Oh, that's the key card for the research. Key card. Ah. I hate key cards. Whatever happened to good old bolts and padlocks? That's what I want to know. I think something just changed. Like my view went a little bit weird for a second. His body is covered with bite marks and scratches. All right, now I need to get back. Alright, we're about to go. Here we go. Okay. 
Oh. Let's get the hell out of here. I need to get back to the research spot. So, wanna let her rock a few more hours, make her really appreciate this daring rescue attempt, or shall we go uh, let her out now? Make the most of her while she's vulnerable. Huh? Nudge nudge. Wink wink. Eh? To be honest, I don't even think she's real, so I'm really not expecting to find anything. I know it's right behind me. I oh god, can't go that way. It's gonna become yep, it's gonna be coming back. Just go, just go, just go. Don't run, don't run, don't run. Nice and calm. Nice and calm. His flashlight doesn't reach. Okay, I remember seeing this. Go this way to get back. Yes, there it is, right? That's it? Yeah, yeah, that's it. I really don't think she's gonna be real. I really don't think she's gonna be real. Research station is encountering technical difficulties. Please have your personal cyanide capsule at the ready. That looks like a really angry looking little baby thing. It looks like it's just about ready to punch me. It looks like it has its hands up in defense, like, yeah, come on, fight me. What the hell? I could probably even break it out of its little capsule container thing, but I'm not going to do that. Alright, where, where is she? Again, I don't think she's real, but... Assuming she is, where is she? Not looking healthy. That's actually a roll of real toilet paper! Before I saw a roll of toilet paper made out of, like, newspaper, this one's actually real. Hello? What the hell? Why are there painkillers at the very bottom of the trash? Lengthy medical texts. I really don't have time to read them, much less understand them. It's that depressing music again. It's so depressing. Amabel. Let's not go in there yet. Nothing. I guess it's broken. What is that? Oh, it's a sweeper... thing? I, I'm not quite sure what that is. Oh, must be pictures of, um... her and the people on the base. Photos of the research team. Very distinguished. Looks like the kennels, I think. It's locked. A small sign explains that this is Dr. Swanson's office. There's a locked door in research room leading into Amabel's office. Let's go ahead and save.
They... They're a part of the process. They're taking me, sealing me inside so that... So that the virus can grow. They're partitioning my mind, putting me inside so that he can take over. They're imprisoning me. This is suspicious. This is a mighty suspicious room. I'm gonna prop the door open. <laughs> um, that made an, that had an interesting result. Okay, that's why I was suspicious. Oh, looky here, more perilous death-defying action courtesy of the skinny English professor. Rambo, you are not. Try running towards him, screaming for a change. Right, I don't think any of this is gonna help me. This might, though. Fuck you. I think I need to crush him with a box. Here, take an egg to the face. Come on, come on. Okay. Oh, fuck. It's stuck. I don't think I can move until I pull the chain. Oh, it's not all the way up. Okay. Here. Take a gray rock worm to the face. It's squishy. Look at it. It's disgusting. Okay. Okay. I can see the shadow. I can see the shadow. Um... That is an awfully small box, I've just realized that. That shadow is, um, exaggerated by the fact that it's closer to the light. Ow. Oh, and it's moving all around, that's great. Okay, hold on, I'm gonna put you right there. Stay, stay. It worked. Give yourself a slap on the back with a crowbar, why don't you? Oh, uh, one thing, before you get too overwhelmed with glee. I know murder can be a lot of fun, but uh, didn't you quite like that broad? Hey, I think that's a piece of her skull on your shoe. Wait, don't tell me you really thought. I thought you knew I was pulling your leg. Oh, my best late plans and all that. This, this is just terrible. You silly Billy. Come on, monkey. Take a joke. And that is precisely why I hate Clarence. Of course it could never be. How could it? How could it possibly be? Well, I can go into her office now. There's probably nothing around here. Pictures of some really strange fauna. Seems like deformed animals. Yeah, putting that in front of the door was, um, had an interesting result. Kind of phased through it a bit. just a hunk of flesh on this thing. And why is the entire thing gyrating up and down? Boy! 
boring. Where's the games on this thing? Oh. Airlock. Alright, what have we got on this thing? Diagram, diagram, antidote. Turngat virus field research. Cure? Amabel Swanson. If you're reading this, I guess you won't have to put up with me anymore. I know you will have tried your best, so I suppose... Thanks for giving me that, at least. I thought I'd knock something up to help you, just in case I wasn't around to do it myself. Uh, sorry it's a bit formal. Force of habit, I guess. Abstract. The purpose of this procedure is to formulate a cure that will stabilize the infection in the host, and if possible, reject it entirely. Experiments have shown that injections covering as much as 50% of the brain tissue can be... It's supposed to be reversed, right? Rev reversed? Reversed? Re hmm. Reversed at an 80% success rate. In rare cases, the mixture will destroy both host and infection. Ah, the luxury of having no choice. Equipment. Compound mixer. Type. Blah, blah, blah. Built from substance analyzer. Chemicals. Oh my god. Okay. The most important addition is Substance 65. I've only had access to 12 and 67, which have proven to work with varying degrees of success. 65 has similar, though exaggerated, properties to 67 and was discovered just before infection, so it should still be quarantined within the chemical labs. Method. All chemicals should be combined within the mm -hmm, and stored according to listed order. At default settings, the storing will be automatic and chemicals can be poured in the machine in any order. Substance is to be inserted into container slot. It's vital that the chemicals are mixed in the following order. Chlorine, acetone, iodine, okay. <laughs> Note that due to an error during manufacturing, the lower button row got reversed numbering. <sighs> Great. That's going to be fun. Alright, mix, so mix it. Inject the host with up to 3 milligrams. All chemicals and equipment should be stored in examination room. Predicted effects. Since the viral aspect of the host mind is likely to be weakened or inflicted... It's likely to be a weakened or inflicted portion of the original host identity, the final state of the host is unclear. I guess I'll never give up on the fairy tale ending. It's also likely that some remnants of the viral capabilities may remain. Telepathy, memory, perhaps even the ability to communicate with the central nervous system. Seriously, though, even if we didn't quite get our happily ever after, thanks for trying. It meant a lot to me. This broad, we, uh, sorry, you, kill her off. And she's still chatting a lot of piss and wind from beyond the grave. That's about as likely to work as aromatherapy is to cure cancer. Just fuck off. Shelter population growth. <laughs> yeah, that looks about right. I guess this would be the, I guess this would be the point of the infection, right? Bigger, 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 and everyone's dead. And my mutation rate. Look, that's the time the uh, the tomb was discovered and everybody was infected. Diagnostics and shmup. What the hell is that? Let's do that in a second. What is shmup? Um. I. Th hmm. I'm not entirely sure what this is. I actually think it might be related to some sort of an Easter egg type thing. Didn't work. <laughs> yeah. All right. What's what is this? General status. Facility condition critical. Transportation inaccessible. Chance of survival seventy-eight percent. Error. Recalculating. <laughs> oh, it was two decimal places off. Great. Experimental status. Actually, wait, no, that's that's not experimental, that's experimental status. Is that even a word? I don't think it is. Yeah, it's just misspelled. Experimental status, subjects, chimpanzee, three, lab rat, twelve, human, three. Condition unknown. Visitor throughput. Last new visitor. One year, two days ago. Last confirmed exit. Eight days ago. Total exits last year, 31. Total exits this year, 3. Total visitors this year, 1. <laughs> that would be me. Operational systems. 
Life support? 36%. Catering? Offline. Transport? Offline. Communications? Internal only. Security? Offline. Plumbing? 100%. No further information available. Hey, plumbing's 100%. Great, we can flush the toilets. Major events. Searching log for recorded events. Please wait. 21st of August, 1972. Accident 18C occurs. 1st of April, 1973. Construction starts. 3rd of March, 1975. Construction complete. 6th of January, 1992. Substance 63 and artifact 66B discovered at Site B. 27th of April, 2000. Investigation of tomb. 35 logs corrupted and could not be recovered. Research status. St status. Research status. Current research projects. Project C567. Status completed. Outcome negative. Project blah blah blah. Completed. Negative. This one. Ongoing. Outcome unknown. Hmm. Alright, so now I need to go to Chemical Airlock, wherever that is. I still have no words for what Clarence did. For what I did. I held my anger tight to my chest and used it. I used it to keep going. I intended to use it to cure myself of Clarence forever. Oh, we're gonna fucking get rid of Clarence. You know you'd be awfully lonely without me, don't you? We're really not that bad together. Why don't we just call it quits, huh? If you stop trying to destroy me, I'll give you a shiny penny. Alright, so there was one of those things here, but it's not. It's not here now. Good. This place is huge. Broken glass and holes. Gunfire? I've never seen bullet holes before. Ooh, that look, looks like it might go to the airlock. Chemical laboratory. Where am I? I'm here. So to my left, I will go... There will be five, which is chemical research lab. Is that where I just went? No. I think this might be where I mix the substance, but if it is, then I still need to do a lot before I can do anything of substance here. No pun intended. Oh, damn! There's a gas leak! Guess we won't be getting through today. Let's come back another lifetime, eh? Monkey? I'm sorry, w were you talking? I just heard some sort of obnoxious buzzing sound. <coughs> uh, oh, I still have a gas mask. Sweet. I think I need to do some pipery here. Here we go. This pipe is full of holes leaking gas into the room. Must be a way to fix it. Maybe I can break it. Ooh. I know. Crazy, you say? Break the pipe that is leaking gas? Isn't that just gonna make it worse? Well, yeah, for a second. Until I do this. I can't attach the pipe. There's a safety lid on the pipe turn... Uh, on the pipe turn in the wall. Oh. A reinforcing plate to keep the pipe system intact. Not anymore! Ah. <sighs> An emergency door. I'm very sturdy. I have a feeling this door only opens if something is terribly wrong. Oh. 
It opens automatically. Take a right turn. <laughs> they're, they're everywhere. Don't go on. Turn around. You'll get us killed. You've you've said in the past you want me to die. I'm not gonna take a right. Fuck you. I'm not gonna listen to you. Nope. Okay. Uh, maybe I may maybe I should listen to him. Oh god. Oh god. Switch. <laughs> switch, switch. Quick, there's a switch back there. Be careful. Wait, what did the switch do? I don't even know what the switch did. I don't know what the switch did. What did it do? Make a little wall for myself here. What, what did the switch do? I don't even know. Let's try it again. Is it timed? Oh god. It is time. Oh. There he's being locked down. They know I'm here for sure. I have to find a way to stop it. Oh shit, there's a camera. They know I'm here. Who's they? Who's monitoring anything? That is that a is that a power source? Can I break it? Look at that. There's something over there where I'm aiming. Looks maybe I can break it if I had an object, but I don't. Okay, I can go that way. I have no idea what this is what this is, but it gives me the creeps. Oh god. Don't want to set off the alarm. Maybe I can break those, but I need something. I have nothing. Actually, that's probably not. I look kind of like a power thing, but I think it's just to feed, like, these things. <laughs> it looks like it saw it? No. Ah, oh, shit. Is there no time in between? Uh, not really. Maybe? You might be able to make it if you run. Let's go this way. That's better. Uh, I need to hit a switch. All right, I could go under it. I can definitely go under it. Like, is this some sort of automatic security protocol? I can't imagine there's someone actually behind this stuff looking at the, the cameras. Okay, here's the switch. I have no idea what this is, but it gives me the creeps. Looks like they've leaked out and broken. All right, so wait a second, and right now. Just wait a minute. Maybe we got off on the wrong foot. You don't have to go through with this. We can be friends. I don't want to die, monkey. You've already said you do. Make up your mind.
Ooh, batteries. Do I really care about them? I have 12. No, I don't. Alright, there's the switch, but I don't know where I need to go. Is there anything behind here? Nope. I think I can just hang out under it. Yeah. Oh, okay, it's right there. That's gonna be hairy. What the fuck? I wasn't in the light? Well, shit, what does that mean? What does that mean? Does that actually do anything? I wonder what that did. Hmm. Right, yeah, I'm actually not sure if it's timed. I think it is. Because I know I pressed the lever before and it didn't... By the time I got there, it wasn't activated. Okay, we're f yeah, oh, yeah. Okay, I was too slow. I have to say, this security system is wildly improbable. Who would ever set a system up like this? You have to, like, communicate on radio with somebody that's off in this strange corner and is holding the lever, like, uh, oh, can you open the door? Like, great, yeah, you have five seconds to get in. The great place to put the switch, like, what? what's the point of this? Oh, wait a minute. What the? Maybe it's not timed? It's activated. Are there multiple switches? Hmm. We must explore. Alright, I came from over there. There's nothing over there, so it's gotta be something back here. Ooh, batteries. Ah, there's probably another one back there. Mm-hmm. So wait, how many times you activate the alarm determines how many of these you have to press? Is, is, is that it? Oh, that's back to the beginning. Okay. shit. This room is a dead end. If I barricade myself in here, I might be able to buy some time to think. Okay. All right. Buy myself some time to think. Substance container. Dead workers are inefficient workers. Always wear safety goggles when handling hazardous materials. And be sure to store your personal cyanide capsule well away from archaic issue aspirin. Okay. Right, so that's what this stuff is going to be put into, right? Sturdy looking, some sort of emergency door. There's no visual lock or button to open it. I sure hope he can't come in eventually. I hope the time I bought myself is unlimited time. Ooh. A collectible that I don't care about. Fuck you! Ew. Ew!
What is this? Instructions on how to operate the containment chamber. How to manage unstable substances with stabilizing fluids. It's all very detailed and complex. I better be careful. It's stuck. According to the instructions, this operates the flow of stabilizing fluids to the chamber. Better leave it be. Oh, I need to get the substance from containment. Okay. That's the substance. Oh, oh, oh. Careful, careful. Uh, do I have it? I do. It doesn't really look like I have it, but apparently I do. Substance. I better find a way out of here. I can't go back the way I came. Ooh, that is sounding nasty. That sounds violent. What the hell have I done? Oh god. What is even going on? Get the fuck out of my way. God damn it. The hell does this do? I don't know, but I'm gonna do it. It's probably important. I don't know if there's something behind me or what, but... Am I okay? Let's save. I can't save. What do I need to do? Um, head for the examination room. With a substance in tow, I was... I was close to ridding myself of the disease. Once that was done, I hoped I'd be able to contact the Turngat mind, as had my father. I had to know what it was they told him to make him give up like that. I had to put an end to this. I know what you're thinking. You're thinking you've got a way to destroy me. Wanna know what I'm thinking? Oh shit! I'm taking you. I'm thinking I need to fucking run. Oh my god. Oh fuck, they're fast. Examination room. Examination room. He is right behind me. I don't know where the fuck the examination room is. I think I'm okay. Oh my god, he's fucking with my mind. Oh. No, it doesn't matter. He knows where I am. Viruses can spread quickly. Avoid all unnecessary bodily fluid exchange. Oh, fuck. I have no idea where the examination room is. I can't stop to read the signs. Examination. Oh, I'm back to where I just came from. Yay. Examination room. Research room. Examination room. This way. Here we go. Examination room. Fuck. I don't even know where I just went. Where did I just go? Is this the examination room? <laughs> Is it? I don't so, know, but I'm saving here it. Here we are. End of the line. No gold watch. No thanks for the laughs, Clarence. Nothing. 
Just a potion and a big fat screw you. Good times. Yep, I'm gonna be mixing this stuff. Alright, I need chemicals. Some notes with strange chemical formulae. Or, is that formulae? How do you, how do you pronounce that? Formulae? Formulae? Complex medical compounds is not one of my strong points, I'm afraid. Some weathered newspaper clippings from 1999. They're difficult to read, but seem to be about some disease spreading around the local population. It is a year 2000 calendar with the 3rd of March marked. Doesn't work. It's an old and rotten shelf. I'm surprised it's holding up as well as it is. Looks like someone wanted to make sure whatever was on that computer remained a mystery. Jesus, yeah, did a number on that. Locked from the other side. Oh, well, I know where I'm going. Or not. Various cleaning equipment like soft soap, sponges, and detergents. Ooh, chemical. Iodine. It's a grate covering the ventilation shaft. Do I have something that could break it? Not really. This is not what I do. Man, I broke these things all the time in Penumbra Overture. Hmm. Color me surprised. What is the color of surprise? Blue? There's bound to be a big old needle at the end of this. That'd be enough to put any man off. No shame in that. You don't want to catch <laughs> anything. One virus is enough for anybody. A quite ordinary and unimpressive landscape painting. Seems a bit out of place. Perfect. That's always a good sign. Blood marks. The ventilation grate has been ripped from its place. There's blood all over the table. What happened here? Rusty lockers. For personal belongings, I presume. Why are these chemicals always hidden behind some random crap? Very strange. Ooh, vans. And this- ooh. This has got to be the mixing... room. That thing is disgusting. Oh my god. 
The body is hooked up to that machine with a set of tubes. What kind of experiments were they doing here? 